this baked cheesy cauliflower was delicious and even better we grew it in our own backyard. This cultivar of cauliflower is called Robber. I grew it from seed this year and it did really well. It's uh, going to be another one we grow again in the future. So once you get it inside, give it a really thorough wash, clean it out. All the nooks and crannies might have little debris of dirt or who knows, maybe a slug because we grew this totally organically. I do have some bugs. So give it a really thorough wash, chop it up into florets and you're ready to go. I love the flavor of Gouda and the way it melts will work well for this dish. So this is a seven ounce block. I'm gonna shred it and toss it with the florets. I seasoned with salt, garlic, sweet paprika, cumin seeds, and dehydrated onion. Then toss to coat everything evenly. You can keep it vegetarian and bake it right now, but I'm gonna put in some spicy sausage to make it a one pot meal with some meat in there. I'm gonna spray the inside of my cast iron Dutch oven. I'm gonna pour the mixture in there nice and level. I'm gonna bake for 25 minutes with the lid on at 400 degrees. Then I'm gonna take the lid off, turn the temperature down to 350, and bake for another 15 minutes. Before you dig in, let the cheese and the juices settle for 5 or 10 minutes just like you would meat and it's going to be juicy and delicious. 